Agro Suede and welcome everyone to Agro Suede Backyard Garden with me, Mitchell Juno Suede. I'm quite sure you've heard me mention before that the property is for sale. And a property being for sale meaning the backyard garden is also for sale. So one of the things that I have to resort to doing is planting some trees in containers so that when you know the property sell, I'll have some plants to bring with me wherever it is that I'm going. Now, as much as I desire to actually grow more fruit trees in the backyard garden, I have to leave the opportunity for someone else, whoever buys it, to plant what they want in it. So as a result of that, one of the things I'm going to try to attempt to do is to grow a banana tree in a pot. And I see this as a perfect opportunity that when we sell the property, that I can actually take a banana plant with me. A banana plant from the backyard garden, however, I have it in a pot growing. And of course, if you can't see the timing tree behind me, that's one of the plants I'm very happy that I actually grew in a pot and I didn't plant it in the ground. And this timing tree is actually very rare. Remember, it's a sweet tambourine, so it's a good thing that I planted it in a pot. So when the time comes also, I can take this plant with me. Um, but I'm going to show you how you can try possibly to grow your banana plant in a pot. Let's go ahead. I have never grown banana in a container before, but I'm assuming the same thing applies like growing it in the ground. So I, I think this can do. Now because the plant is mainly on that side, I rather this be more centralized. So I need to get this on the side here. I'm just trying my best to get this cut. Just gonna try. So eventually it will make up, you'll come up, you find the way out. Right. Okay. As you see, we're bending because of the way I throw the tree in the compost area because it's on the side, so the plant goes good on the side. But eventually, when it starts to get nutrients and water and sunlight, it will come up like that. Right here. So I'll eventually trim this part off. So to get this, right. so this should be. Let me just use two more for this. You can do it. Fit. So now I'm going to add some compost material here. Now I'm adding some compost material so you can start decomposing for the banana tree to get food to it. I'll keep monitoring the plants right here because I don't want it to, to die. Although I doubt this will die, bananas are very strong and resilient trees, except to black sugar to get him. But whenever a banana tree falls, if it dies, it will send out new suckers. So never give up on your banana tree. Well guys, I hope that you actually enjoyed this video, I hope that you are motivated to try your best to grow a banana tree or a planting tree of that sort in a pot or container. Thank you for all those of you who have subscribed to Agro Suite Back Kid Garden. Thank you for liking our Facebook page. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter and Instagram. And remember guys, a Back Kid Garden in some ways will keep the doctors away. And Agro Suede is out.